guys till 16th or 17th week after fertilization we lay in mother's womb as a mass of flesh being organized now what happens after this is the electromagnetic wave electromagnetic waves are those waves which does not require any medium to travel nor are they visible gets entry into the flesh once it gets entry into the flesh the transducers transducers are those which converts one form of energy into another converts this electromagnetic wave into volt of survival voltage current shock voltage of survival why do i call it as volt of survival because our entire process goes on only on voltage whatever we are seeing whatever we are hearing whatever we are smelling whatever we are talking or emotions everything is converted into volts and that volt goes into our central nervous system so that's why i call it as volts of survival now every person has different volts of survival all right that's one thing second thing is that this electromagnetic wave which was in zero dimension no length breadth and height now got converted into volts of survival or into which it is now three dimensional all right it would stay three dimensional in form of volt of survival till delivery it all depends upon whether it's a still baby or not delivery then again adolescent then again youth then old age and then decay of body on ultimate decay of body that is during death then again during death what happens is it again gets back from volts of survival three dimensional which was captured in three dimension to electromagnetic wave now mind you if you have observed in general whenever a person is in death bed there's lots of vibration in body all right palpitation vibration respiration goes very high as per me what happens is the transducers are picking up all the voltages from entire part of body and converting into electromagnetic wave owing to which that vibration that uh, respiration and that palpitation and all those things process is happening so volt of survival is being converted to electromagnetic wave via transducers all right so that's the reason why this palpitation and this respiration and all those processes occurs this is one thought which is there in me second thought is about why do we appear and behave like our parents or ancestors why i have a feeling that it's all tree your family is one tree my family is one tree their family is another tree all right of electromagnetic wave now these now assume this is my tree of electromagnetic wave my tree of electromagnetic wave in the sense all my ancestors had got electromagnetic wave from this tree all right so i got electromagnetic wave from the same tree and it got entry into me all right and what happened when i was mass of flesh being organized it took care of genetics of dna so it did all those genetic engineering making me appear and behavior wise very close to my family to my parents to my ancestors all right so this is the thought which comes to me all right but yes i there are also recombinations that is there are changes also mutations also that also happens via accident or via process of meiosis that also happens otherwise we would be clone of our parents these are two main thoughts which comes to me now mind you these are all my thoughts i have not referred anywhere anything these are all my thoughts i just felt like sharing with you and if it matches with somebody else's thoughts then it's 
a mere coincidence all right so basically two things so one thing is electromagnetic wave being converted into volt of survival by transducers that's one thing so zero dimension to three dimension back again three dimension to zero dimension after death not visible because electromagnetic waves are invisible to us second thing is that tree thing all right your tree my tree their tree all tree different owing to which emw that is electromagnetic wave which gets entry into us converting to vos that is volts of survival that we was doing genetic engineering in developing us i would be putting in such thoughts more such thoughts about soul having gender soul does it have memory and varieties of such things i would be putting on series on these i hope you enjoy it okay see you again in my next video